Welcome back to another Cool Loser Tech video. These are the best games of the week on the Nexus 7, so let's do it to it now. Well, what do you know? It's the Cool Loser for show. Here on Cool Loser Tech, let's stop the show. And for the best live wallpaper of the week, it is called Hallucinogen. Look at it. You are not getting sleepy. You are going to wait to the end of this video because I got something important to say afterwards. Three, two, one. Alrighty, let's get it on with the best games of the week now, shall we? And I'll start it off with some easy games for everyone to play with, with Yumby Smash. Tap to start that you can unlock for different stages, which is more coming soon. Let's do eight. Along the way, it's gonna teach you what you need to do. If you can actually see that there's a little Android guy dancing around, you can touch on him, and you will have to drag out, and you will see that there's actually arrows telling you where you wanna go, and tap on it, and with, you know, smash through things, and then you got little bad guys there. If you tap on the guy, he will actually uh, do a little slow-mo, and you could do slow some more there, and you can use bombs, I just went into the game, which is kind of confusing for you to understand right now. And you get rewards and unlockments, and let's see my scores, I get 86, so I can do better. The more boxes you smash, the better score you will get. And you gotta get all those little desserts, right? You can zoom out. let use a bomb. Go in here. The more stuff you smash, the better points you get. You have to try it out for yourself to get the hang of it, so go do it to it. Next up, we have Wrestle Jump. Two players meet playing on the same screen. All you gotta do is just press on here, and you see there's wind, and I'm the blue guy, and I just lost right now. What? You're probably saying? Well, you gotta understand that there's a guy who you can have, ah, and I lost again. So protect your head and your back. You can get body slammed, and you have to get to five stars. And if you actually hold your legs up, ooh, there's one, my point. There's no, like, needing to tilt your device. It's just kind of really funny watching them jump around and then flip. And let's hope the wind's still launching us that way. Protect your head by holding the button because the feet is longer than your body. Here's my chance to win on camera. Oh, what? Ooh, jump, jump, jump. Come on, careful, 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 careful. Oh, come on, come on. No! Ah. Black wins. Here next we have Speedway GP. Lots of levels. There's a marker that you'll be able to go through. You're gonna go into your career mode and see practice plays, count the trophy rooms and get, it's not like you, what you would expect it to be. It was a little bit like, eh, but you know, I bought it anyways and I have to show it off. So, I don't remember if I have to tilt. No, no tilting. The graphics are not like horrible, but you see I'm still ahead of them because I'm doing pretty good. You can go into the controls and you can see you can change the distant close, the helmet cam, let's do helmet, and you can do the tilting, and let's do that one, and let's press back, and let's resume. So now we got a helmet cam, and now we can do the tilting. Getting dirty. That's so realistic. We're gonna try it out for yourself. Next up, we have Turbo River Racing. You'll be able to select different kind of boats if you have enough coins. I don't know if they're gonna be fast or not, but this is what you're stuck with. Let's go to level four. So every time you keep getting further, you're gonna be able to play in those levels. Let's go to play. Like much, much harder than the first and the second level. See, you gotta go through those rings because they will count and determine how many times you've been if you collected them all from the beginning. And those coins will obviously will get you new stuff. And let's do a trick here. Oh, I missed one actually. 360. 360. See the sharks are starting to come out. Don't hit them because you'll lose lives when you go through here. That's what's going to determine the next part. Jungle here. So then as you see here, don't hit those. Then you got your alligators here. Ah, come on, I gotta get those turbos. Oops! And that's how this game is played. So if you like it, go try it out for yourself. Next up we have Flick Home Run. It's like baseball, and as soon as I tap, I got a smack. Oh, that was pretty bad. If you miss, it's gonna drop down a whole bunch, so try not to miss. Let's go to the pitch, and 
There's the hit, and you see the balloons? I have no idea what the balloons are other than they give you points. And let's do a further than that. I've been all the way out to like 800 feet. You gotta get over the stage. I'm getting a whole bunch of points going on, and my life is still up there. Now, what I'm gonna do is swipe early, and it's out. So you can't swipe until it passes the screen, and you see how it's deplenishing pretty quickly. This is pretty much my last try. Then I'll do a drum roll and horrible. And then total points right there, and then that'll experience you. And then once you get past the max section, you'll be able to upgrade your contacts, your power, and then your batting eye. Now there are different levels here, but you can't get it until you actually level out. If you like it, go try it out for yourself. Here next we have Kiwi Run. Let's go to play. Unlock little kiwi sidekicks there. So once you're here, it's very simple. Give you directions, a jump, and then swiping down will dive, and then you can flap. The turtle right there will help you for, oh, like that. The longer you hold, you don't have to do the tapping, but it looks cooler. Oh, so now, I think that's the last of the turtle I'll see. There's my best run. I haven't got very far. As you see, my little sidekick got lost. Gee, do it, do it. It's my turtle friend down there. Oops. Oops. I got a shield there. So go try it out for yourself. Here next we have Monster Galaxy Exile. Do you guys loved Pokemon growing up? This is like that. As you see here is my team, and there's 157 Mogas. That's what they're called. You gotta catch them all. One, two, three, four, and you get to name them whatever you want. A whole bunch of other ones to catch it. So let's go into the gameplay, and then you get this guy talking to you the whole along the way. Now I can play with this guy. They're in the same level. So let's do a Zodiac. 69. Not effective at all for this guy. You can switch anytime. Click on here. As you see, the health stays the same. Let's do a Zodiac. Gemini! That's me. For the record, my birthday is on June 11th. What are you guys gonna give me? Do an attack, let's finish him. Bam! He's gone. Next guy's falling up. And new characters as you see. And another guy? Woo. Go try it out for yourself. Next up we have Diner Dash. All the levels that it will go through. You can see there, let's go here now. Go. You get customers coming in and you have to direct them where they like to be. Drag them there. Got these red guys. Go coffee. Bring them to the tables. Go back here. Bring them there. Bring these guys here. And you just gotta hurry them up. Put their hands up, ready to order. And you can just go on like this and bring it back. So it goes through all the tables. Want their order? There's four. Four is there. Let's go three, two, two, and three. And these guys are done eating. This is a check. Pick up their stuff, take it to over here. See this guy's at the wrong table, they'll kind of be upset a little bit. Um, it's dirty, the table's dirty. Who's gonna sit on a dirty table? There's the order. Take it to take it to the take it, take it in. Take it up, there's one and three and one and three. And these guys are ready, so let's take it then. The game is a little complicated and it's clean up the table! <laughs> You guys are gonna have to try this game out. This one is angry because I'm a bad server. What am I supposed to do? What do you want? Give her coffee? Okay, she's happy now. Go uh, try it out for yourself. And last but not least, we have Daydreamer. Three stars up there. That determines of how many times you can launch these little things. Who remembers playing this game where you have to do like these kind of asteroids and destroy them before they hit to the ground and you see that have the chain reaction kind of going on an explosion. Just tap right here and boom, 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 boom. 
Don't let them hit anywhere in your house area, your tree. Don't let it hit you at least the most part. Oh, oh, that was a quick loss. Oh no, no, I didn't lose yet. But the, but the, <laughs> it's just that the fact that that's taking forever. I always lose in the 70s. I haven't gotten any higher. So if you can do a lot better, you already know what to do. Go download it. Go tell me and brag how far you got in the comments below. And there you guys have it. These were the best games of the week right off Google Play, brought to you by me, the Cool Loser. And as always, please rate, comment below, and tell me what you think of my show. And I always want to innovate and come up with something cooler and better and, you know, new and fresh. I mean, a lot of people say, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. It's true. I'm not going to change anything on you without your, like, consent. So hear me out. So what I plan on doing is releasing 10 videos, which you guys know I do Monday apps, game Thursday. And if I don't do Mondays or Thursdays, I do Tuesdays and Friday. But here's the deal. What I want to do, it'll be more direct, more shareable, and easier actually to edit because I can make one whole video for the app or game. Like for example, the games that you saw today. If you wanted to see only one of them, you get that one game only and it can be two minutes long so it's all concentrated into one section and then you can move on by looking at the other videos so that gives me more views more people to find me and therefore if developers from Google Play or other people want to share just that video they get to share that video instead of having all those other apps or games they have that one keep in mind is that if I do go this way if two months from now you didn't download this game and you want to check out this one game that I reviewed during this time, you know you can scroll down and see like, what's that game? It looked like this. And I'll have the game picture on the icon. Instead of having all those nine icons of different games or applications, you'll be able to recognize what app or game that was. But don't worry, you'll still be able to easily recognize what section it is because I'll have a, like a short little video of me being in the center. And as you see on the sides right here, since it's going to be opened, like black right here, I'll be able to put in like the five row of applications. And then over here, five row right here, you'll be able to click on the first one. And it'll take you to that video if you want to see it. If you don't want to see the video, then don't. I'll have the links in the description below where you can just click on whatever that application or game it was. So you don't have to watch it if you don't even want to. Go in the description below. Download on your tablet, on your phone, or your computer, watch it. And then this gives us a chance to be more face to face. I'm not used to being on camera because I'm always recording off of it or I record people. So being on it, it's a little bit different experience and I have to get more comfortable. And I've said it before in the past videos if you watched me before, but I'm trying to get myself more recognized. So that's pretty much what I want to talk about in this video. I will make a whole demo video. I want to try it for one week to see how you guys react to it. A lot of people are like, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Yes, it's true, but I want to bring something new and offer something better and eventually saving up money and maybe a better partnership comes up and they make me earn money, I'll be able to do more devices. Like I got my tablet, obviously I always use my Nexus 7. I always use my Galaxy Nexus. A lot of people think, hey, why your Nexus 4? This isn't the Nexus 4, guys. I actually, oh, uh, look at look at the, the background uh, or on the screen as you see. Let's bring it closer. And that is like my setup right here. That's the webcam that I'm using. My new camera right behind it. You can't really tell. But I didn't like the Nexus 4 because of the screen. That's the only thing I didn't like about it. That's why I didn't keep it. I'm just used to, you know, the LED screen. I know this is LCD and not LED, but I wanted a Nexus 7. This is in my everyday device, but it still looks good. I will do a demo video. I'll show you how I want to do it. So. Hopefully it goes good and hopefully you guys like it. It will make a big difference for you and me. And that's pretty much all I got to say as I twirl around here. <laughs> as you see, my room's really empty. I had to move things out because I refinished things. I built things and my bed and bird will be back in here pretty soon. This drawer right here, somewhere around here, my guy will be and the cage will be there. So we'll be able to probably see him. <laughs> hanging around here flying towards me with the other little bird that you guys named Charizard by the way you guys I asked my youtubers what's the name because I had him for like a year and a half and I never gave him a name and you guys named Charizard and my bed will be in here too so I'll have least space to do this but at least I'll be able to jump and fly and squirrel dive a little bit and then maybe sometimes when I get some chicas they can be dancing in the background all in their sexy lingerie but if you like that I am here face to face with you. I'll keep trying hard to make things a lot better. 
Keep it spicy. Keep it cool. All righty, guys. Until next time. Who's there? Oh, Daddy. Later.